Verse 20. And he confessed and did not deny, but confessed, I am not the Christ. Listen, when John was asked, John the Baptist is asked, he knows who he is. You and I, if we know who we are, one of the first things we're going to know is who we're not. We are not the Christ. The world does not revolve around you and me. Friends, to know who you are, you need to know who you're not. You and I both. When we understand who he is, we'll better understand who we are. Amen? And that really begins by understanding who we're not. And, and I know and you know that if you go around and you say, excuse me, sir, do you think that you are God? Oh, of course not, you moron. What kind of question is that? But look at their lives. If instead of asking the question overtly, if you just watch them and said, are they living like somebody who thinks that they're God? Are, do they actually make their own rules? Are they the center of their universe? Do they think that life is really all about them? And then turn the question inward. Am I living like I think it's all about me? Am I living like my rules go? Right? I know what the Bible says, but hey, I live in the real world. Well, if that's the attitude, then you live lost in the real world. Because the children of the king will know him as Lord and obey him. Right? To love me is to obey my commands. Is it important that you know who you're dealing with? Well, I'm a card-carrying Christian. I've taught Sunday school my whole life, blah, blah, blah. Here's my resume. This is who I am. Say, well, that looks great. Only problem is your life doesn't look anything like that resume. Friend, I love you enough to tell you there's a problem here. Verse 22, then they said to him, who are you so that we may give an answer to those who sent us? What do you say about yourself? Friends, I want to ask you. What do you say about yourself? The real question is, what do you say about yourself with your life? Let me see the measures of your time, your talent, and your treasure, and I will tell you the answer. Show me what is happening with your time, your talent, and your treasure, and that will be what you say about yourself. Verse 23, he said, I am a voice of one crying in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord, as Isaiah the prophet said. Friends, here, I encourage you in your own study time, go to Isaiah 40 and see where John the Baptist is quoting from. First, note this, he's asked a who question, and he gives a what answer. He's asked a who question, who are you, and he gives a what answer. What can you take away from that? Here's what he said. Listen, my purpose is bigger than my person. My purpose is bigger than my person. He knew who he was. He told them what he was. I am a voice. Remember the beginning? In the beginning was the word. Jesus is the word. John is the voice. Friends, you and I are to be the voice. We're not the Christ, but we're the Christians. We're not the Christ, but we're the church. We are not him, but we are his ambassadors. I am the voice. His purpose, your purpose, Christian, is bigger than your person. 